Right, I don't see a hell of a lot of these to be honest, and um, I've um, got three of them, which um, is kind of weird, but um, not the intent. Uh, the intent is to have one. Um, this is the IC900 uh, or 900A, depending on the, the particular model. Um, we've got uh, two 900As and uh, one 900. Um, and the way to differentiate is the um, modules over here, what they call the B modules. So you've got uh, Unit A and Unit B. Unit A is the uh, common one. Uh, basically, uh, this gave you the ability to um, remote the modules by fiber optics um, uh, unit B modules uh, quite a, a distance away. So we're just actually powering up um, <coughs> excuse me, a 900A at the moment uh, just with 2 and 70 uh, on board as you'll see underneath this bit here um, you've got the 144, 430 and then unit B as an interface. Uh, the second one here which is the uh, 900 uh, has 144, 1.2 uh, gigs and 430 megs and the third one is very similar to the first one. Uh, then we've got obviously uh, spare unit A's that go with the uh, spare units here. Uh, and uh, of course uh, more front panels because without those they would be uh, not so good. Alright so let's just have a look. Um, uh, this is really just a brief look at one of these fellas. They're, they're um, pretty much, you know, look, um, iCob microphone like everything. Um, and uh, uh, this is uh, 25 watts from memory. Let's have a look. 24.9, make a liar out of me. Let's have a look. 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 1, 2. Yeah. That's nice. Um, certainly uh, transmitting okay there. And if we pump a little bit of signal into it, let's just have a little look. Oh, yeah. Let's just turn some volume down here. And let's um, let's knock that signal back a bit. Oh, these are... Yeah, these are good. See, that's hearing... That's hearing right on 0.5 of a microvolt there. Uh, so um, yes, yeah, no, that's that's really quite nice. So basically, um, uh, you've got um, just the two bands showing up uh, at any one time. From memory, I haven't hooked up the other module yet, but from memory, it was the UHF band that became the 1.2 gig. But um, uh, I probably should have hooked that particular module up, um, and uh, so we could have a little look at that. Well, let's do that. So I thought it's probably wise just to. Um, hook up and show you the uh, 1.2 gig. So what I've done is I've, I've just basically used the module with the three, uh, let's have a look here, the three units on there as you can see. And uh, actually I haven't got my 430 meg powered up at the moment, let's have a little look at that, find out why that's not powering up. Um, but um, uh, we're basically having a little bit of a look at um, uh, 1.2 here and uh, and two meters. So. Um, uh, now I haven't got any dummy loads connected to, oh hang on, yes I have, if I go to, oh let's just change that around, we should get something come up on, uh, these are entirely different um, modules, those are the ones we were using just before over there, so um, <laughs> could be a different result, let's have a look, what do we got, 11.3, I reckon that's in low power, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, uh, let's just have a little look here, see if we can actually hear something would be good. One, two, three, four, five, one, two, one, two. Yep, and I'll check that power, but I think that that could come up a little bit. Um, but um, I can't really test on 12, 1.2 gigs. This analyzer goes up to um, uh, one gig, which uh, makes it a little bit harder uh, to, uh, to put a signal into it. Um, I'll just see if I can at least doctor something up. Right, so we are cheating a little bit here, and there's no way we'll get an accurate reading, but we will see if the 1.2 module's working. One, two, three, four, five. Yes, yeah, it's working okay. Uh, but yeah, we're not going to get um, the 10 watts uh, the <laughs> on that meter, that's for sure. Uh, but uh, yeah, look, um, great little unit, and um, uh, a little bit sort of old school in a couple of ways they do things. Uh, you know, they basically, when you go through your set range here, um, uh, you're basically setting your uh, blah, that there is sorry setting uh, your um, uh, increments I'm just trying to get my fingers around this and I have actually gone into set mode of 1.2 actually let me get out of this I, I thought I was doing something wrong uh, let's see if I go back over to bring that over there right AB 
600 split, tone 88.5, um, uh, they were band edges there, and back to your memory. So it, it's not um, it's not overly hugely impressive, but these were well, these were just something that um, uh, people, um, especially the 1.2 and 430 meg people, you know, had a bit of fun with. Um, but uh, we'll probably keep one of them, not three. <laughs> it's uh, not really going to be needed. But um, uh, but yeah, certainly um, um, uh, drop us a line if you're uh, interested in one of them. We'll, we'll get rid of two and keep one just as a display here, and uh, certainly uh, hand one over to you without too much trouble. All right, um, it's, it's not much else we can really do. Uh, pretty much. Um, uh, because of the independent uh, bands coming off the back of this, um, you know, I'm forever going to be changing cables, just ch checking bands, and, and and that's fine. We can we can certainly do that. Um, actually, I might just have a quick look at that 430 meg, and and just a lesson to uh, everybody out there, including me. When the light is not on on one of these, it means that you've actually switched the band out. So at the moment, I've got um, 440 megs and 146.7 up and running. So of course the only two modules that need to be on and powered up are the um, 144 meg and 430 meg module, which makes a lot of sense. Um, so um, on UHF, oh boy, hang on, that's a lot of feedback there. Uh, but UHF, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, yeah. No, it's doing fine. Um, I, um, I think they're 10 watts on UHF from memory on those. Oh, I need to check, but anyway. Um, nice little setup, certainly um, a, uh, a bit of a blast from the past. Uh, you won't see IC 900As and 900s very often. They uh, it took a long time for me to find one, to be honest. Well, three even. Um, but it was three in one in one lot. Okay, 73s from VK3, Charlie Mike.